Hey there, sixth graders. We're here to talk about simple machines. And your next assignment is to find 30 different simple machines in your house. Uh, 30 different items that have simple machines. So, what are the simple machines again? We've got a lever, incline plane, wheel and axle, wedge, screw, and pulley. And uh, I have two assistants here again. Uh, let's introduce our first assistant. What's your name again? Chicken Dinner. Chicken Dinner? <laughs> What's your name? Refrigerator. Refrigerator. All right, Chicken Dinner and Refrigerator. So, here's what you have to do, sixth graders. Uh, I looked in the kitchen, I looked in the toy box, I looked in the toolbox to find different uh, simple machines. Now, if there is an item that has more than one simple machine, it is called a compound machine. Think of compound word as two words put together. A compound machine has two or more simple machines. So, <clears throat> an example is this. And what is this used for, young lady? Opening cans. Opening cans, good. Now, a couple different simple machines here. If it has a handle, it is probably going to be a lever. In this case, yes. This is a lever. Um, you turn it to open the can. This would be an example of a wheel and axle. This actually has gears on here, which is a form of wheel and axle. And it also is a wedge. A wedge is anything that cuts. So this will cut the can when I squeeze down. And so it actually has three simple machines. It has the handle, which is a lever. It has a wheel and axle and a wedge, all in a can opener. Uh, next one. Oh, let's go with this. Tape dispenser. Okay, for packaging tape. Well, what kind of simple machines do you think is on do you think are on here? Well, it is a wheel and axle, that's how the tape turns. And this is a cutting edge to cut the tape, so that would be a wedge. So wheel and axle and a wedge. Uh, let's see. This is a heart-shaped pencil sharpener. Can you guess what it does? What does this do? Sharpens pencils. Oh, he's good. He's real good. Now, uh, obviously this has got a piece of metal that's very sharp to cut the wood, so it is a wedge. A wedge cuts anything. Okay. Uh, right. Do you know what this contraption is, sixth graders? What is this thing used for? Any idea? Squeezing lemons. What do you think it's used for? Squeezing lemons. Squeeze. These are the tiniest <laughs> lemons I've ever seen in my life. Um, what do you think lemons. it's used for? Squeezing lemons. No. Chuck E. Cheese lemons. Chuck E. Cheese. Okay, now you're just crazy. No. It is called a garlic press. You put garlic in here, and then you squeeze down on it, and it comes shooting out here in it's strings. What I said. Okay. <laughs> now, uh, this is this has handles. You push down and pivots right here. So it's called the fulcrum. So it is a lever. Another lever here. Um, here's a wrench. Okay, you put it on a bolt or nut and you turn it. Okay, and so it's a handle. So it is a lever. Another lever. You can see this is pretty easy um, to find lots of simple machines, and you have to find 30 only. I should have made it more. Scissors. Okay. Uh, handles. It's a lever, and it is used for cutting, so that would be a wedgie. I meant wedge. A wedge. Okay. Uh, you're probably wondering why do I have a toilet? <laughs> It is a Barbie toilet, and what simple machines are on a toilet? Well, you see how this goes up and down? Okay, it pivots right here. The toilet seat is a lever, okay? And usually it's bolted into the, into the floor, and so that bolt is a screw, so it also has a screw on it. Um, this let me go on to... This one? Oh. Here's an easy one. What? Kind of simple machine you see here? 
Yep, it is wheel and axle, and actually it's got a wedge, or an inclined plane, I should say. Uh, windshields are an inclined plane. Put that back, please. Now, let me get something out of the fridge here. Ah, here we go. A big jar of pickles! Oh, uh, can I eat them? Ah, sure. What kind of silver machine is on here? You might be saying, Mr. Anderson, a jar of pickles. Simple machine. What? Well, look, you got to turn it. So it is actually a screw here. So you're going to drink the pickle juice? Yes. Okay, I, actually, I do have to see this. <laughs> Don't backwash. Okay. All right, how was it? All right, it's good in case you have sore muscles, maybe. I don't know. So anything that's got a lid, it screws on. That is... A screw. It screws on. It makes sense. Um, here we go. Golf club. What would this be? It is a lever. You got your handle. The load is a golf ball. You swing back and you hit it. It pivots right on your hands. Of course, I'm not holding it, right? Okay, like this. And it is a lever. Um, so, those are just a few examples of simple machines. Uh, please look around your house. Uh, kitchen's a good place. Uh, garage, toolbox is a good place. Make sure you put everything back. Uh, bathroom, there's, there's a lot of simple machines in a bathroom. You wouldn't realize it. So um, that is your assignment. So why don't you check out that Google Sheet and start filling that out. All right. Have yes. a great week. I got more. Oh, boy. Pick a